Hello, boys and girls. Today you are going to be making a quilt. Qu -qu quilt starts with the letter Q. You're gonna have a little manila square, a big manila rectangle, and a big blue rectangle. For this activity, you're gonna need a black Sharpie, a pair of scissors, a glue stick, and some crayons or markers. So the first thing that I'm going to do is you're gonna leave your big blue paper just like this is gonna be the background. I want you to cut your manila square and you're gonna make it into a circle. So we're gonna cut all four corners, one, two, three, four, and now I'm gonna round the corners, going back and getting those little points. And I'm gonna take these pieces off. Now, I would love for you to glue down the white rectangle. And this is gonna become our quilt. So I'm gonna make a big rectangle of glue on the paper and then flip it over. I'm gonna put it in the middle. I'm gonna wrap it and count to five. One, two, three, four, five, okay. Now, before we glue down our next piece, we need to make our quilt. Now a quilt is a, um, a blanket made of lots of squares. And so Mrs. B is going to make, now the squares can be all different colors. So I'm gonna make, here's one square. Could be different shapes too. I've seen lots of quilts with rectangles and sometimes they even have patches on them. Mrs. B is gonna make hers right now so you can see it. I'm gonna start making mine, but then I want you to complete yours. So you're gonna pretend that mine is finished. And then we're gonna make the person sleeping. Now to make the person sleeping, we're gonna put the head, like it's sticking out of their covers. I'm gonna make an O there. And I'm gonna glue it down so that it overlaps the quilt. Rub and count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Now with my black Sharpie, I am going to make the eyes so that they look like they are sleeping. Look, I'm gonna make two curves and then I'm gonna make little eyelashes because everybody has eyelashes. They help protect your eyes. And then I'm gonna make a nose, which is a little curve. And I'm gonna make an open mouth <gasps> like they're sleeping. And now you can make hair on your person. Mrs. B is gonna make her my hair. Now. You have probably been working really hard on finishing your quilt. Mrs. B's gonna catch up to you. I'm using lots of different colors. What kind of colors are you gonna use? Are you gonna make a Loma Vista quilt? Is it gonna be purple and yellow? Is it gonna be a Star Wars quilt? Maybe it's red and black. What kind of quilt are you gonna make? I'm gonna make a big, rectangle for this part. A quilt is just, remember, a blanket made up of lots of different pieces of fabric, so they can be all different sizes. I'm almost done. I'm gonna make two more. Thanks for being patient and waiting for Mrs. B. We're gonna have one more part that we're gonna finish for our quilt. Yeah, we are gonna write Q and U together. Ready? Here we go. Uppercase Q, a big circle, and the little kickstand, the little line, and then lowercase U, qua, qua. Mrs. B's gonna write her name. Q and U, Q and U. Now you know just what to do. Have fun.